Hey guys, so um, Teresa Collin stuff is being clearanced out at Joanne's, which we all know that. So this beautiful embossing folder, see how huge it is, 8.5 by 12. It was on clearance for $1.97. There's two ways you can do this if you don't have that expensive um, machine that goes with these larger dies. You can put your paper in between the sandwich and roll it with a rolling pin. I got this rolling pin for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Um, I don't. It didn't work. It didn't work that well for me. But also, my hands are just weak. My wrists are weak. It came out faintly. Not bad. You can still see the texture. And if you uh, spray that with like a gold spray or something in the opposite color spectrum it would be really pretty and I was like well I'm not giving up on this because first of all I bought it just because it was so pretty it was you know these big beautiful I think they're called cottage roses so I was like okay next so yeah I desecrated some Teresa Collins I know she's like one of the gurus and the goddesses of the craft world I cut that puppy in half I use my recollections paper and I use my old beat the hell big shop machine. And yeah, I can work with that. Can you work with that? I can too. So don't get discouraged if you see these big, beautiful Teresa Collins um, embossing folders that are way huge 8.5 by 12. Buy them anyway at $1.97. If you have a cutting machine or you have a friend with the regular Big Shot machine, cut it in half and you are still going to get a really great deal. And you've still got tons and tons of those beautiful cottage flowers to use on your, your cards, your layouts, whatever. That's um my quick tip from the table. How about you? Alright, talk to you later. Bye-bye.